chase no fucking blows up. Bitch, I make it rain, y'all. You did that. What's up, y'all? This is I, and I'm back at it again with another video. <laughs> Anyways, this video is gonna be about car fusions. Now, um, I'm gonna try to make a weekly. What's today? Tuesday. I'm gonna try to make it a weekly theme to drop a video on tips and tricks. That's why right, tips and tricks. And this one is gonna be focused on car fusion. I want to show you guys how to use car fusion, how it works, and you know, give you some tips on what to do when you start, you know, wanting to get better cars. So, anyways, left eye. I don't know exactly what how many cars I got on my own left eye but I'm actually using the SP edition too and um I've been sticking with this ever since I got it because of the plus seven attributes uh, I mainly use it for block but everything else as you can see is is pretty um pretty not useful for me like long dunk tussle this is more of a center or power for it so um, the substats helped me, help me a lot. Help, <laughs> help me a lot. The quick jump and action speed, dive and catch, and mid shot defense resistance. Also, long layer defense resistance. Now, as you come to fusion, you can fuse together a lot of cars. You got, you can get the different variety of cars. You can get, you can get normal cars. That's the green magic, rare, and legend. Now, this is what you're aiming for: a legend car. And um. Mm, the better legend car you had, the um, you know, those, those are just the best. So, anyways, um, I heard the quickest way to get a legend car is to like fuse a bunch of legends together. If you fuse five legends, you will automatically get a legend car. Now, I don't have that many cars on here, so um, actually, I won't be using any of these cars. I believe I take that back. The one to play deck. I didn't even much know I had that. They give me block, three point defense resistance, tussle. Also for a big man, as you can see. I don't know what's the special skill on that. But we gonna use another character. Well, actually, I'm just gonna ahead and show you. I got a bunch of rare cards. Now let me fuse five rare cards together. Now I put five. It's gonna take. By the way, you need points for that. It's gonna take your points up. Now you see, I have like a. 5% chance uh, I don't know the percentage on this to get a, um, a legend and that's not a pretty good percentage so um, I'm not gonna waste my money on this but though that's that's how the bar is you need to get this bar completely filled with the red color legend color I'm gonna go on baby eye because I believe I have um, some good cards on baby eye a bunch of legends cuz I remember buying a bunch of a bunch of card balls and just opening up trying to get good cards on my baby eye and I wanted the main of ginger you know just make it in my main class if I hopefully pulled another good SP deck but I, unfortunately I couldn't I spent like $150 opening card balls and this the best cards I can get and it kinda made me sad <laughs> but yeah it's whatever though. I still got blue eyes. She's still a beast. Anyways, I should have a lot of legend cards on here, as you can see. Um, let's get started. Now, attribute badges. Let's say you want to um, you want an offense card. These attribute badges can be obtained from events, also the DIY. You can come to the DIY tab and um. You can actually make these badges. All you need is 30 screws. These screws right here, and to get screws, you gotta play the game or this, you know, disassemble some stuff. Like, I'm not gonna use these gloves. I'm probably not gonna use these socks, but I'm gonna keep those socks anyway, cause they fresh. Let's see, um, these gloves, for instance. So once I disassemble the gloves. Uh, I got buckets of paint, but that's how you mainly get screws and all these other stuff you need. So anyway, let me create. Most likely, I'm 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 gonna buy each one, each one. I'm gonna buy one offensive badge, D 
defensive badge, a talent court badge too. Also, there's another thing over here that you can make. Um, it's called. If you scroll down in the use tab, material legend card, you can also make these. And these are like the same, it's on the same level as a legend card. It will count as a legend card. So like if you can't, if you don't, you know, have any legend card, if you can make five of these, these will also work. You can fuse these with um your cards. Anyways, let's go back to the fusion. So yeah, if you buy card balls, you just have a bunch of cards left over that you're not going to use. Damn, although card balls suck, most likely you're not going to get anything from it. <laughs> because the chances, the RNG in this game is pretty, pretty. Uh, it's, it's screwed up, you know. It's, it's a lot of cards and card balls. And the chances of getting the SP deck now than back in the days is pretty unlikely. But anyways... Damn, you see how I did five legend cards. I got a hundred percent chance to get another legend card. Now let's say I wanna I want an offensive card, pick the offense badge, bam, fuse it. It took 10k to make this by the way. I just spent take care on this. And I got another toy edition one. Bam. I could try this again for y'all since I had the extra <laughs> extra cards and stuff. But yeah. This is another way you can get yourself good cards, y'all. So uh, I wish you the best of luck. Just, let me see if what I get from this. I'm gonna try a ton of card. And I get new challenger. Something I'm still not gonna use. Anyways, y'all, this is the tip of the day, Car Fusion, you know. My tip is, pick a position you like, PG, SG, whatever it is, and spend your money on that character so that character will have the most stat items on that character, you know, on their account, or whatever. My words are not coming out like I wanted to. But just stick to one character, open up a bunch of card balls on it, and you can just fuse away. If you don't get the, you know, if you ain't lucky enough to get a card deck, SP edition. Anyways, y'all, thanks. And I will be making more tips and tricks. I'm going to try to make this a weekly thing. So, next Wednesday, I will see y'all again with another tip and trick. Oh, by the way, leave a comment. Leave a comment on what tips and tricks y'all would like me to make it could be anything like how to guard dash not how to guard dash i think i did that already if i didn't i would make it again and um i can make a tip on attributes you know just let me know what y'all want and i will get it peace out